Welcome. Welcome, guys. How are you doing? My name is Jay, and she is listening. Laney. There today we're gonna review movie, The Meg, do, The Meg, do, and The Slender Man. Gotcha. Hey guys. Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome to Welcome Geek, Geek by Heart. By heart. Yeah. Why are you always rushing in front of me? Oh, probably because you're, you know. Um, we are going to do a double feature for half the time because yes, it sucked. What we did, we, we both went to look at separate movies over the weekend. Mm -hmm. uh, I went to look at The Meg, she went to look at Slender Man, and now we're going to give you a double feature for one deal you went to watch slender man i went to watch uh the meg well you know what i'm gonna let you go first okay because i know there's a lot of things you want to talk about yes so. and i'm gonna try to do it in half the time the because in all Take honesty it was like ridiculous anyway i watched the slender man it's directed by sylvan white it stars joey king annalise basso um i remember her from oculus she's the redhead from oculus oh okay. i don't know if you remember that mm -hmm. jack sinclair and uh julia gold uh gold dining sorry if i pronounced your name wrong and it's basically it's basically if you think about it it's the ring meets the slender man creepypasta the end basically you have four girls who are bored one day they look up the creepypasta the slender man they read this thing on the internet to basically like um summon him and he basically either kidnaps them or makes them go crazy like it's done in the ring fashion mm. okay they bring nothing to the genre um i'm gonna start off with my bag geeks i'm sorry um so i'm gonna try to condense this really quick boom fake ass ring if you've seen the ring don't see this okay it's nonsensical i mean the girls do the dumbest shit that you would ever think not to do and they still do it okay like i said i'm trying to make it really slim so i'm not going to go into detail because y'all ain't got to see it i'm sorry i would not want to be friends with these girls at all uh one like when one girl went missing they were like oh, oh, oh we gotta find her and then when the other friend went crazy they was like no we're not trying to find out why and then when one girl um the girl joey king who plays ren she actually kidnaps one of her other friend's sister to try to um sell it to the slender man not sell it but try to like give it to the slender man and then Haley, who is another girl instead of trying to look for her friends or trying to make sure that her friends are okay is really concerned about going on a date i would not want to be their friends so slender man kind of came out three, four, five years ago, and you're now making a movie, number one. Number two, it's not scary, okay? I mean, there are some PG-13 movies, but honestly, this could have been a PG movie. It was that non-scary. The only good thing about it is that, A, if you're scared of trees, then the sound, uh, the sound mixing, that when the Slender Man comes sounds like creaking trees, that was kind of creepy, but again, not scary. I did like the chemistry between um, Haley and her sister. I'm sorry. I really, no. <laughs> no I'm not trying to be funny. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm really trying. 1.5 out of 5. Thanks. <laughs> the Meg. <laughs> okay, well, the Meg. I'm sorry. The Meg, the Meg, movie. the Meg. Oh, man. Well, the, okay, the Meg stars <clears throat> J J Jason Statham. Well, basically, the Meg was basically about this shark. It's it's a huge kind of like a, a dinosaur type shark, okay. which basically was a prehistoric shark, a mega a meg megalodon. Me megalodon, yeah. Whatever. So Jason Statham was a part of this um, undersea um, rescue team. He's on. He's a part of this undersea rescue team, and he. Um, there was this, this there was this team of, of, of deep divers who went past the core or the deepest part of the ocean something like that and now Jason Statham went down and they they released some sort of um, gas that exploded the flooring of the the the, um, the 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 portion of the sea or the portion of the ocean that 
was basically the deepest part, mm -hmm. so to speak. They got the the largest shark to come up, and it started creating havoc with the the deep divers in a um like a undersea type research facility. Mm -hmm. And um, that was basically it. Okay, well for this though, my bad geek, my bad geek about this movie is that this whole story felt unbalanced. It was it was boring to me. It was boring. Um, you know, the, the, the whole idea of the the big fish trying to get to these researchers on you know at the undersea research center, mm -hmm. and that was basically the whole thing. My next bad geek, um, not to be don't please don't compare it with Jaws. It's it's not Jaws. It's below Jaws. Do, Jaws is way above that. Did you see Jaws four? What? Jaws four. Jaws four. Yeah. No. Okay. <laughs> um, my thing again with the movie, you know, being being that I'm a black dude, you know, <laughs> always the, the, it's like everyone that. in the movie is the bravest, except the black dude. The black dude is like this, the scariest dude ever. <laughs> he's like, oh my god, he's like a little punk. And I'm like, why that is, happened in the why is, why is everyone so, that so why is everyone so um so brave and courageous and daring and everything? And black dude is like, oh my god, come on, man. That happened come in the on. Man. You know, there was just too much things within the movie that just sucked. Yeah. Okay. I, I didn't like the visual effects. Um, the final fish flat, the final fish fight was blah. There wasn't. It wasn't like the it wasn't like the, the the grand finale of of fish fighting, you know, to kill the fish or to kill the the shark. Yeah, another thing about me is that the the, the idea of the big shark. By the way, we're still on bad geeks. That's how many bad <laughs> geeks I have about this. Movie. That's not fair because I could have done <laughs> tremendous amount of bad geeks. Oh my god, <laughs> the idea of having a humongous shark, I, I, I think it takes away from the whole. Um, I think it takes away from the whole, uh, whatchamacallit, suspense of the movie. There's nothing to work with when you have a huge shark. Because, mm. you know, it's, it's, it's like you're trying to fight, you're trying to find ways and means of using that huge shark to, to um, kind of eat people, which in your sense is, is going to be a bit difficult because it's really huge. You okay. know what I mean? It, the base, the base attack points would basically be like boats if it's gonna swallow a boat or whatever because it's a huge shark mm. and it's actually two of them it's two sharks two huge sharks it was two michael down yes yeah, it's, it's like two of them um jason statham in the movie i just did i i don't like him in this movie because this movie is not for him horror movies is just not for statham statham is an action dude you know, I'd more use I'd more use Statham for Hitman, for a Hitman movie. Okay. I'd more use him for a Hitman movie, but movies like this that basically is like a horror, horror type, type um, like attack shark attack. What that's not for him. And for the movie during the movie, they in the beginning of the movie, Jason Statham's ex-wife was the one that um, got in peril with. Uh, two other um, two other persons that was in the submarine with her mm -hmm. and once Jason Statham um, rescued her you don't see her no time at all mm -hmm. that was it <laughs> oh my god to how they made her character involved you would think within yourself that well maybe she's gonna be a part of the movie but she wasn't and you only see her like two times mm -hmm. and that's it that's it and she was in the same facility where the shark was attacking the, the, the facility and you hardly see her. Mm -hmm. So, you know, she, she was useless to me, you know. Um, and that's, that's my bad geek and the good geek. The only thing that I have with my good geek is that it's a good high candy for shark movies. You know, if you're interested in seeing like a large shark. You like may sound like it was gigantic, a sexual thing. I'm like, what? You know, like a gigantic shark <laughs> trying to high attack. Candy. You know, it's it's. They want to see all that blood and guts. Nah, it, all it, that teeth. I wasn't, I wasn't feeling it. So, that's my good geek, bad geek about the movie. Um, I don't know. It's, it's. I don't know why. Uh, you know what? I, you know, as as I said, we are basically geeks, and geeks meaning like, 
anything which is both comic books, whatever, whatever, whatever. But we are geeks of horror movies as well. Mm-hmm. And we were like hoping to see these movies that you know, probably. I knew Son of Man was gonna suck. <coughs> you know. I'm sorry. I was hoping the Meg was gonna be okay. The Meg. I was hoping know, that, and, but and I knew Son of Man was gonna suck. But for the least, I, I gave the Meg a, a three. Three out of five. Are oh, you nice? Okay. You know, and as I say, it's the, why I give the three is because, of course, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a very entertaining movie. It's 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 one of those movies that you go to and pop a few can, um, pop a few popcorns with your friends and watch it like on a Sunday afternoon or some shit like that. I don't recommend it. I don't even recommend it for that. Yeah. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm not the Megs again. I didn't see the Meg. I saw mm. Cinnamon. Man. So my comment is, I don't even recommend it for that. Yeah. It's just so nonsensical, and you don't like. I personally yeah. didn't like the characters. Mm. I didn't. It just was so nonsensical. Wow. Like, no, seriously. Like, there was a father who um, broke into one of the girls' homes. The father of the first girl who mm. went missing mm. broke into one of her best friends' home. Um, the girl named Haley, and then they go back the next day and sneak back into his house with one of the other girls playing distraction with the father. Wow, that's that's fucked up and ready. <laughs> that's fucked up ready. Yeah. <laughs> and no, 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 no. The best part about it was like, okay, so how are they gonna get out? Do you know as soon as they got what they wanted from that girl's um, room, the next thing you see was them already at the next place? You didn't see how they got out? Mm, yeah, these, yeah, these, uh, well, you know, that's, <laughs> was, that's 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 just our take on the Meg and, and the Slender Man. So, um, as usual, too slender for as you. Usual, <laughs> oh my God! As usual, please subscribe, and you can check us out on Twitter and and uh, Instagram. Yes, you forgot uh, it. By you? heart, yeah. <laughs> you know. we're live we're, we're there we you know we we post a lot of stuff mm -hmm. and it's geeky and you guys can check it out you guys can you know submit and and you know comment and do whatever you want to do you know this is jay laney we're here we see you next time